workouts, and helpful advice. Add this video to your favorites. It will guide you when you train. Next exercise, posture exercises for adducted shoulders. Go. Don't bend or curve your back. Keep the abdomen constantly tight to stabilize the spine and avoid injuries. Next exercise, posture exercises for shoulders and dorsal. Go. Do all the movements slowly to avoid shoulder problems. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, arm rotations. Go. If you can't do it, try the rotations with your hands on shoulders. Be sure not to lift your shoulders. Keep them down and relaxed. Don't bend your arms. Keep them constantly flat. Don't bend your head. Keep it always in line with your back. Five, four, three, Two, one, stop. Next exercise, curl. Go. If you can't do it, try decreasing the weight. Don't swing your back. Try keeping your abs tight. Don't lift the shoulders. Keep them down and relaxed by concentrating on your biceps. Don't bend your wrists during the movement. Keep your hands in line with your forearms. Descend slowly to increase the effectiveness of the exercise. Don't bend your head. Keep it constantly in line with your back. Try staring at a fixed point. Be sure not to stretch out your arms to avoid joint problems. You can use water bottles or books as alternatives to the small weights. Stop. Next exercise, reverse curl. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Rotate your hands slightly upward to avoid wrist injuries. Don't arc your back. Keep your abs tight to avoid spine injuries. Don't lift the shoulders. Keep them down and relaxed by concentrating on your biceps. Don't bend your wrists during the movement. Keep your hands in line with your forearms. Descend slowly to increase the effectiveness of the exercise. Don't bend your head. Keep it constantly in line with your back. Try staring at a fixed point. Be sure not to stretch out your arms to avoid joint problems. Stop. Next exercise, hammer curl. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Don't swing your back. Try keeping your abs constantly tight. Don't lift the shoulders. Keep them down and relaxed by concentrating on your biceps. Don't bend your wrists during the movement. Keep your hands in line with your forearms. 
Descend slowly to increase the effectiveness of the exercise. Don't bend your head. Keep it constantly in line with your back. Try staring at a fixed point. Be sure not to stretch out your arms to avoid joint problems. You can use water bottles or books as alternatives to the small weights. Stop. Next exercise, concentrated curls. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try simple curls. Don't swing your back, try keeping your abs tight. Don't lift the shoulders, keep them down and relax by concentrating on your biceps. Descend slowly to increase the effectiveness of the exercise. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go! Don't bend your head. Keep it constantly in line with your back. Try staring at a fixed point. Be sure not to stretch out your arms to avoid joint problems. You can use water bottles or books as alternatives to the small weights. Water break. Three, two, one, go. Next exercise Arnold Press. Go. If you can't do it, try simple dumbbell shoulder presses. Be sure not to raise or lower your elbows. Keep them constantly at shoulder height. Don't bend your neck. Try bringing your chin back. Don't arc your back. Keep your abs constantly tight. You can use water bottles or books as alternatives to the small weights. Stop. 
stop. Next exercise, lateral shoulder raises plus shoulder press. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Keep your elbows and hands at shoulder height when you bring your arms up. Don't lift your shoulders when bringing up the arms. Keep them constantly down and relaxed. Don't bend your neck. Try bringing your chin back. Don't arc your back. Keep your abs constantly tight. Be sure not to bend your wrists. Your hands should be in line with your forearms. You can use water bottles or books as alternatives to the small weights. Stop. Next exercise, front raises. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Don't leave your elbows down. Keep them constantly in line with your hands and shoulders. Be sure not to bend your wrists. Your hands should be in line with your forearms. Do not bend your neck. To help, bring your chin back. Don't lift your shoulders when you bring your arms up. Keep them down and relaxed. Stop. Next exercise, hammer lateral shoulder raises. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Keep your elbows and hands at shoulder height when you bring your arms up. Don't lift your shoulders when bringing up the arms. Keep them constantly down and relaxed. Don't bend your neck. Try bringing your chin back. Be sure not to bend your wrists. Your hands should be in line with your forearms. Stop. Next exercise, single bent over lateral raises. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights. Don't bend your head. Keep it always in line with your back.
Don't arc your back. Keep your abs tight to avoid spine problems. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. When climbing, move only your arm. Your shoulder and scapula should remain still. You can use water bottles or books as alternatives to the small weights. Water break. Triceps kickbacks. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or no weights at all. During the distension, keep your elbows still, only move your forearm. Exercise pulls triceps kickbacks. Three, two, one, go. If you are unable to complete this movement, try slowing down the pace. Don't bend your head, keep it constantly in line with your back. You can use water bottles or books as alternatives to the small weights. Don't stretch your legs, they should always be slightly bent. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, stop. Next exercise, triceps kickbacks plus dumbbell wide rows. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Don't stretch your legs, they should always be slightly bent. During the distension, keep your elbows still, only move your forearm. Don't bend your head, keep it constantly in line with your back.
you can use water bottles or books as alternatives to the small weights. Stop. Next exercise, triceps press. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Don't move your elbows when you bend your arms. It is important that they remain still. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go! You can use water bottles or books as alternatives to the small weights. Keep your abs constantly tight during the exercise to improve balance. Stop. Water break. Three, two, one, go. Next exercise, deltoid stretching. Three, two, one, go. Don't force the movement. Stop when the shoulder has reached its maximum tension. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Don't rotate your torso. Have your shoulders always facing forward. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Next exercise, arm and chest stretching. Go. Don't force the push. Stop when you feel that you've reached the limit. Keep a slow, regular pace or else you might risk joint problems. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, stretching biceps and forearms. Go. The hands should be at shoulder width. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go.
five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, stretching triceps. Go. Do not overdo the push. Stop if you feel pain. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Do not curve your back when you bring your arm backwards. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Try out our full workout plans. More info in the description below.